the fastest way to grow your unique business. Hi, I'm Samantha Studebaker Carl coming at you from beautiful Southwest Georgia. And in this video, I'm going to share with you some powerful concepts that if you truly get what I'm about to share with you and implement the techniques that I talk to you about, you will never struggle in your unique business or any other business online ever again. So let me just start first of all by uh, telling you a little bit about myself so you can understand where I come from, you know, where I get my knowledge and why you should listen to what I'm about to tell you. Uh, you know, I've been in network marketing off and on over probably about a 20 year period of time. And during that time, you know, I worked with companies that uh, sold household products. I've uh, done companies that uh, sell roadside assistance, uh, legal advice, uh, personal development, um, blogging systems, you know, just all kinds of different things you know if you you name it I've probably done it or something nearly similar to it I know there's thousands of MLMs out there but uh, you know I've done probably about 20 of them <laughs> and you know I was never successful to with any of them and uh, you know until I actually got online and started learning these concepts that I'm about to share with you and once I was able to learn these concepts and implement them in my business I've I've made as much as three thousand dollars in one day and one and then another day I just literally almost not it was almost like snapping my fingers and made four hundred and twenty five dollars so when you get what I'm going to be telling you you'll be able to do things very similarly to what I just described now I'm not guaranteeing you any kind of results because you know I don't know you you don't know me I don't know if you're going to implement the things that I tell you I don't know if you are going to even listen to half of what I say but I can tell you this that if you if you take these concepts to heart and you truly think you truly understand uh, exactly what I'm going to share with you then you know growing your business online actually leveraging the internet to grow your business is going to be something that makes it uh, so that you can be very very successful and unique as well as any other venture that you uh, that you decide that you want to do um, so let me just kind of talk to you a little bit about these concepts now um, the, the main thing that you want to be able to do is you want to establish yourself as an expert online now why do you want to do that um, one of the things that um, <clears throat> that I've learned over the years is that the main reason that people will do business with another or that people will do business with their a, any business is because they perceive some level of value from that place now let me just give you an example let's say that um, <clears throat> you are uh, you know you're flipping through the yellow pages okay this is the old-fashioned way of doing it right <laughs> uh, you're flipping through the yellow pages and you see like all these names down here and all of this is business name business name business name phone number phone number phone number okay and then all of a sudden you see an ad that says uh, you know and let's just say that you're looking for um, I don't know the best pizza in town or something like that you know and so you see all these pizza places you see their phone number you see where they're located um, but then you all of a sudden you come across this one big ad and it says voted best pizza in uh, your you know whatever your metropolitan area is then instantly you have this perceived thought that oh this place is you know it's the best obviously so I want to go there you know so if it's close to you you want to go there and if you can kind of uh, you know position yourself in that way excuse me um, then you're gonna have more success now online it works a little bit uh, differently because what will happen is people will do a search think about this so you're in uh, in the beauty industry right and if somebody is looking for, say, um, you know, fuller eyelashes, maybe they're going to do a search for fuller eyelashes. And when they do that, if you don't come up, obviously they're not going to find you, right? But if they, if um, if they type in fuller eyelashes and then all of a sudden a article or a video or something along that lines pops up maybe a a series of uh, images that show a before middle and after kind of thing if something like that pops up then automatically that person who is doing that search is going to see whoever that person is and be like oh that person really knows what they're talking about okay so let me give you another example um, <clears throat> so when um, when you are, uh, let's just say we're watching television, 
okay and um, you see a lot of uh, a lot of these um, shows online they they are all about how to do this or how to do that you know let's just say there's like a, you know some of those home improvement shows where um, you see these these two people they're in the industry they're interior designers or you know or they're you know rehabbers or something along that lines and they do all this wonderful wonderful work on this home and you get to see the before you get to see the during and you see the after you listen to them talking about how this works and why this works better and how this goes with that and all these different things and you realize that those people are expert and if they were in your neighborhood and you were wanting to have your home remodeled you'd go to them right exactly so what the the point is is that when you can position yourself to be the the person who is providing the most advice in your area you're going to get the most business and when you're online it kind of translates into when you're providing the most advice for the people who are searching for it then then you're going to get the most uh the most business so let me just kind of share with you a couple of different things okay people come online for four different reasons okay one they come online to get their questions answered two they come online for advice three they come online to learn new things and four they want to be entertained and if you don't fall into one of those four categories you are going to have a harder time uh you know making any money online or you know in your business in any way if you're online um, so what you want to be able to do is you want to be able to position yourself so that you are answering the questions that the people are asking relating to your industry and of course we're talking about uh, you know the beauty industry right so let me let me give you another example what you want to be is kind of like um, you know like a beauty magazine so like for instance when you let's just talk about say a particular product out there that you know or not a product but a uh, a product line so like Maybelline or Clinique or something along that lines okay now how do you know about Clinique or how do you know about Maybelline you know either a you're gonna see it on TV or B you're gonna see it in a magazine you know otherwise you know where are you gonna find it you're not really gonna see it unless you just happen to see advertisements on Facebook or something along that lines but advertisements aren't the main reason that you decide that you want to purchase those products it's the perceived value that you get from where those products position themselves so if they're in a magazine for instance that magazine has all kinds of different articles that do these kind of these top three things top three three things they answer questions they provide advice and they they teach people new stuff and so when you pick up a magazine on the on the front of it has all these different articles it doesn't say Maybelline and Clinique on the front it says you know how to uh, cut your hair or how to style your hair in 15 different ways you know how how to uh, do your eye makeup in three different ways you know it it talks about you know how to have better relationships and how to uh, you know how to make your clothes flatter you more and you know and things like that and so when you can do kind of the same thing where you provide what people actually want when they come online when they, if they're searching for you know how to do their eye makeup then you want to pop up there because if you pop up there they're going to see you as the expert and then they're going to want to do business with you because they already know you they like you they trust you all because you've provided with provided them with answers to their questions advice or you've helped them learn something new so like if we go back to the the magazine kind of example is that when you when you go to the grocery store and you pick up this magazine you pick it up because it it uh, you know jumps out at you some headline that gets your um, catches your interest you know makes you uh, want to learn whatever it is that it's about to tell you in that magazine and when you're flipping through there and you get to your article and you read your article and it's about you know hair care or it's about I you know I makeup or it's about skin care or something like that what happens right after that article it's an advertisement you know every few pages there's there's another advertisement and it's always related to what 
is being talked about in the magazine, but people will not pick up the magazine unless there's some level of value there. And so when you are, you know, say on Facebook and all you're doing is posting ad after ad after ad after ad, you know, people aren't gonna be interested in that. People don't care about ads. They care about the information that you can provide them. And when you can provide them with these different things, then they are automatically gonna wanna do business with you, okay? So how do you do that? How do you position yourself in that way? Now, if you are in, uh, you know, I've actually talked to a couple of unique presenters and, um, you know, they've told me that Unique has a number of different resources. You know, I've seen that there's a YouTube channel. I've seen there's Pinterest and, and Instagram, or maybe it's just one or the other. Um, you know, from what uh, they've told me is that, that you maybe you have a group where you can, uh, you know, exchange photos and that sort of thing. So you can share tips and not oh, those, all those different kinds of things. And when you can take that information and offer it to people, then they're going to, you know, they'll be interested in you. So instead of going, hey, buy my this, hey, buy my this, hey, buy my this, instead you can be like, learn three tips for how to get your eyelashes to look more curly and full, you know, or something like that, you know, how to do your eye makeup so that, uh, you know, it stays on all day long, or, you know, the best three tips for doing your, your lipstick so that your lips always look luscious and full, you know, I mean, there's, you know, you, you can come up with all these different ideas of, you know, the, the, um, you know the articles or the advice that you can provide and what will ha what you'll want to do is basically you will set yourself up with a um, maybe you've seen this online where you see on a on a blog it says opt into our newsletter for tips and, and tricks and this and that and the other right well if you have a um, an option to um, give something away for free let's just say like an ebook or a series of videos on how to do your eye makeup or uh, you know five tips for you know having better skin or whatever when you can create a um, you know a series of follow-ups then what you'll want to do is you'll want to go ahead and capture uh, your prospects email address so that you can continue to follow up with them basically what you'll do is that you will capture their email address you'll provide them with whatever this free thing is that you're going to you know give them whether it's a series of articles videos or advice or whatever and then of course every time that you send them something in an email is that you'll you know you put a little PS line in here that says you know did you like this video and uh, you know or do you want to purchase the the products that we talked about in this video go here you know or you know something along that lines or you know learn when you learned about this uh, how to plump your eye eyelashes you know um, here's the product that helps you do that you know whatever and so you provide the advice and then you put a little PS line that says, hey, by the way, here's where you can buy the stuff that we're talking about. That's what it boils down to. And when somebody first, when you first meet somebody like on Facebook, they may not be interested in what you have to offer because, you know, it's a new relationship. You know, people don't automatically just uh, want to buy from you just because they meet you, right? But when you can continue to build a relationship with them by providing them with advice and tips and tricks and all of that kind of thing, that's when they're going to want to uh, buy from you. And then when you do that, here's another cool thing about it, is when you do that, it will actually not only position you in your industry, but if you ever at some point in time decide that you're going to pursue something different, then you'll be able to take your reputation, reputation, <laughs> and people will, um, they, they will believe in you more so that when you switch to something different, if you decide that, you know, maybe, um, you know, the makeup isn't the thing that you want to pursue for the rest of your life, maybe you decide that you want to go in skincare, and maybe you want to switch over to essential oils or whatever it is, because you've established this relationship with people and you've proved to them that you're knowledgeable, then when you switch to a new industry they're gonna they're gonna follow you right along into that as well so okay so guys here's what you need to do click the link below this video because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you through I'm gonna walk you through step by step through all of the different um, tools that you need in order to set this up so you can easily be you know connecting with people uh, by providing them with advice uh, answering their questions and um, you know and learning new things and then um, you know and then following up with them so that you can build a relationship with them so they will want to 
buy from you. Um, so guys, if you have any questions, go ahead and shoot me a message. Uh, connect with me on Facebook. There'll be a link below this video that tell you a little bit more about that or, or tell you a little bit more about me. And, um, you know, and of course you can shoot me questions if you've got them. And uh, in, in the next video, um, I'm going to talk to you more about how you set up each part of the system so that you can easily be following up with, um, you know, with your prospects. And so with that, click the link below, check out the tools that I'm, that I'm going to be sharing with you, and, um, and then we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.